Welcome back everybody, you guys know I love mechanical keyboards, you also know that I know that you love mechanical keyboards, especially affordable mechanical keyboards, and that's what we have in front of us today. This is the Velocifier VM01. What sets this one apart from the other keyboards I've covered is that it's a full size backlit mechanical keyboard for $36. Yeah, and if this video reaches 5,000 likes, I will be giving one away, so just drop a like and comment down below that you want one, and when it reaches 5,000 likes, I will announce a winner in a comment down below. Let's do this. Starting off with the overview, it's made of all plastic, so there's no metal on showing or in the frame or anything, although it's weirdly heavy to be made of all plastic, so my guess is there's some type of metal plate or something in there that gives it a little bit more heft, which is a good thing. It feels premium and it's not going to slide around or anything, but the outside is all plastic, which is excusable at the price point. But what I'm not a big fan of is there's no raised feet. Now it is sort of raised anyway, like there's just kind of an angle going, and there are five rubber feet, so it's not going to be slipping anywhere, but I use... Uh, uh, raised feet on every single keyboard that I own and use so that's really a little bit disappointing that there is no raised feet At least they do give you sort of an angle to work with but the lack of raised feet it's a little bit annoying. Moving on to the keycaps, they're they're definitely plastic, ABS plastic keycaps, but they've got this like texture or this grain to them. You can see it on screen right now. It's hard to describe, but they actually feel kind of nice. I don't know how that's gonna hold up over time, but I do actually like the texture that's going on there. I'm a fan of that. And the LEDs, the LEDs are weird. They're not that bright. They're gonna obviously shine in darkness, so you're covered there, but they're not that bright. They're just a weird shade. Online, they literally call them greenish LEDs. I would call them greenish light bluish uh, kind of, it looks like they're trying to be white, but they're not quite white. They're just this like light blue sort of teal color. Uh, it definitely it still looks cool and everything. I just don't know really what they're going for there. And then underneath those keycaps are these switches. They're Cherry MX Brown clones, so they're tactile, but they're not clicky. There's still a bump in there and you feel when it actuates, but they're not super loud and clicky like MS Blues would be. And what kind of MS Tech video would this be if there was not a typing test? So I'm gonna load up a type racer and as per requested, I'm now going to be recording the screen so you guys can see me as I type. And uh, we're gonna see how fast I can type on it. I normally type around 100 words per minute, so that's a little context. Let's do this. And I also pointed the mic down so you could hear it. All right, 116 words per minute. Very nice keyboard to type on. The MX Brown clones definitely give like a soft typing experience, but you still get the actuation sort of tactility. Very nice. I actually really like the switch type. It was originally my favorite, and then I started to like Cherry MX Blues a little bit more. All right, conclusion time. This is a full-sized backlit mechanical keyboard for $36, and that's hard to beat. This is one of the best deals on a keyboard you can find right now. Yes, it doesn't have raised feet, but it's raised on an angle anyway. And yes, the LEDs are like a weird light blue, but that's really not that big of a deal. If you want a full-size mechanical keyboard, this is absolutely the best keyboard for the price, no doubt. There are some other options under $40 for mechanical keyboards that are 10 keyless, and if you're into that, you can also consider those, like the Red Dragon keyboard and the Tomoko keyboard, I believe, that I reviewed. I'll link them below. Uh, but if you're into a full-size mechanical keyboard, best for the price. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to see more content. And as always, stay classy.